Hey guys, today let's learn how to fix iPhone Wi-Fi not working after iOS 17 update. So in the case that you're experiencing some issues with your Wi-Fi as soon as after you um, updated your devices to iOS 17, well in this video tutorial I'm going to teach you guys how to fix this step by step. So please watch this video until the end to find out how. Alright guys, so what we need to do first is to go ahead and launch your settings application and once you've updated your um, devices over on to the new iOS 17 softwares, to fix this issue with your Wi-Fi you need to go ahead and reset your network settings so tap on general right here I want you to scroll down until you see transfer or reset iPhone and I want you to tap on reset and then tap on reset network settings what that is gonna do is it's gonna reset all of your network settings and uh, included as well is your Wi-Fi and go ahead and just set up your Wi-Fi once more with um, adding your um, Wi-Fi password onto your Wi-Fi and being uh, connected right after and that should solve your problem now once you've already done this method you should go ahead and tap on your assistive touches or just make a quick restart of your device Device. So to do this, tap on your assistive touches and tap on device, tap on more and tap on restart and then tap on restart again to successfully restart your devices. Now once you have done that, basically what we can do if you are still experiencing issues with your Wi-Fi is to wait for the new update. So iOS does periodically releases updates with their iOS 17 softwares since they are aware that there are bugs with this and it is still a new software so uh, people could basically experience some bugs uh, attributed with this. So if you do have an update available, you could go ahead and tap on general and then tap on software update and then see if uh, you have a new update available. Now, as you see, I've already updated my device to iOS 17. But of course, as I said a while ago, iOS or the Apple company does roll out updates even though they have already released iOS 17. So if you do have an update available, go ahead and update it now so that you're going to fix bugs like this and you are going to have the best user experience possible. And that's for this video guys thank you guys for watching please like this video and subscribe as well if you guys learned something and i'll see you guys on the next video